The Guangzhou-based transportation company called Yihang announced in mid-October that it had obtained the world's first type certificate for passenger carrying unmanned aerial vehicles from the Civil Aviation Administration of China. This piece of paper is of great importance, not only because it's the world's first, but it tells us that the model design is safe for taking passengers up into the air. These flying vehicles are actually eVTOL, which stands for Electric Vertical Takeoff and Landing Aircraft. Now you may ask, what's the difference between a helicopter and an eVTOL? Well, an eVTOL is powered by electricity, so it's clean, and it's surprisingly quiet. And unlike helicopters, they don't always require a pilot, as some are fully autonomous. Yihang's model adopts a relatively simple design. Eight rotors with 16 propellers, with a top speed of 130 km per hour and a maximum distance of 30 km. China seems to be more encouraging in its development of these, as eVTOLs are considered a major part of the country's push for sustainable aviation. A development outline for grain aviation manufacturing has been announced by the Ministry of Industry and Information Technology and the CAAC for the period of 2023 to 2035. And then pilot operation plans for these vehicles are expected to begin. In this expanded market, e-vehicles aren't just for commuting. They can be used for much more. For example, the emergency services could use them to bypass traffic and get someone to the hospital much faster. Or conversely, imagine using them for sightseeing, getting unique aerial views of beautiful tourist destinations.